Hey, my name is Wiran. I'm now leading the team to provide the to do the research on the inkjet printing OLED, and we are close to the mass production. This is like a beautiful 8K, 65-inch yeah. inkjet printed OLED. Yeah. Yes. How how crazy is that to make something like this? Actually, for inkjet printed OLED, the the it's easy to standard to understand. So the 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 way is the same as we print papers in our office. So we just make the red and green and blue ink and put it in the uh, printer and let it print to our like driving circuit. Where does it put the ink? Where does it put it? It's like little droplet. It's small droplets. droplet. Yeah. It will drop to the area we want and we dry it and form the pixel. How do you dry it? Like an oven? Yeah, oven and also in the uh, vacuum. And this is 8K? Yes. 8K, 65 inch? Yeah. How soon is it mass production? Uh, you know, it, so we do the research like three years ago and we are still thinking about if we need to do the mass production or not because television is cheaper right now. <laughs> we need to have a cheaper way to do television. Because um, I think you should do it. I'm joking. <laughs> but <laughs> is it possible that it will be affordable? Yeah, sure. A lot, How uh, like a, Last year we have the foldable TV last year, but this year we didn't bring the foldable one come. Oh, you talk about foldable. Yeah, foldable and rollable. I mean affordable. Is it going to be cheaper price? Oh, yeah, oh, cheaper. Is it can, can you make this cheaper than conventional? Actually, you know, LCD is really cheap right now. So we need to compete with the LCD. Yeah, uh, that's a problem. It's too cheap. Yeah, we need to still work TCL a lot. TCL LCD. Yeah, 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 yeah. We yeah. still need to work a lot on that to but get the price lower. How could be the price difference compared to other OLED? AK OLED? Actually, that one we are cheaper. We are about like 20% uh, lower than the other technologies, but still, you know, not as low as the LCDs. Because some of the other ones I saw was 77 inch uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. AK. Yeah. Is there any mark on the market? 65 inch nope. 8K? No. Need nope. a little bit bigger, right? Yeah. Can you print bigger? Yeah, sure. That depends on the line we have. Can you can you make me like a hundred inch 8K if, OLED? If we have G8 point uh, G8 line, like uh, the, the, the production line is bigger, we can do that. We can do 110 inch. <laughs> wow, 110 inch printed OLED yeah, 8K. Yeah. yeah. Next year. No. I'm joking. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. What do what do you have here? So, um, so we we moved to so this we do the develop of uh, TV first, and then we move to the monitor size. This is this mass production. No, this one this is one. Mass, this one is mass part for the medical applications. Nice. So this is a 21.6 4K yeah, okay. printed OLED. Yeah. Actually, With the resolution is higher than that one. So the pixel pinch is higher. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's actually, in theory, more difficult yeah. to make. Yeah. All right. And this one we are using uh, now shipping to some uh, like customers in the medical equipment for the ultrasonic or CT. What is this one? And this one we are developing for commercial. So we are collaborating with some uh, our customers. And hopefully we can uh, ship this to the market um, the end of this year or early next year. So in terms of market placement, does it enable something like 27-inch OLED yeah. more affordable than yeah. other yeah. OLED? Yeah. And For sure. Also, yeah. And also the color is good and the uh, uh, image quality is good and more suitable for like gaming, for the cre creative applications. 120 hertz. Yeah. And we low. can do we can do low and also higher. And this one is 100, 120 hertz. Can you do fast response? Yeah, sure. No OLED, problem. OLED, no problem. It's all fast. Nice. And uh, the blue is going to live forever? Yeah. No degradation? Yeah. Because we're shipping the panels, they do a lot of tests. The blue is good right now. Nice. Okay. And then we um, we use this technology for the um, uh, for the uh, notebooks, and the special thing is here. So we have the pixel pattern, like the RGB stripe structure, is the same as LCD. So the benefits is, let me see if I can show you this one. So if you see the characters here, it's 
the, 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 the edge is like the curve is really smooth and there's no color fringe. So if you look at the other technology, you will see the color fringe. You will see red color and, and green color on the, um, on the, on edges. the edges of the characters. But this one is beautiful. There's, there's no color fringe. It's because of the it's, pattern. Yeah, because of the pattern. And this is the only technology right now can provide the patterns like this. Actually, this is uh, very suitable for printed, right? You want yeah. to print in, yeah. in the lines. lines. Yeah. yeah. It's more easy? Yeah. Yeah. So is all those printed in lines? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we um, we increase the resolution. Actually, this is one. This one is about like uh, 200, 242 ppi. It's you know the resolution is high. It says world's first oxide. Yeah, with oxide backplane to save the power to have the lower refresh rate. So what, what improved since last year? What did you do in the last year on this technology? Uh, we just, um, so we increased the efficiency of the, uh, of the light, the, of the OLED. And also we um, solved some of the yield issue. So that means it's closer to mass production? Yeah. So we'll probably gonna ship this to like uh, Q1 next year. Which one? Two of them. Those two? Yeah. Q1? Yeah, next year. Q1. 26. 2026. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, and, and what is the advantage, the marketing, for somebody who needs to choose this display? So, the, 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 you know, we are using notebooks, right? We, are, we, are, we use so many characters on our notebooks. And if we can provide a, a really good characters performance, people like it. And also the color is good, the color gamma, the contrast ratio is good, and the, uh, the, the picture quality is good. So people love it. And our customer will really want that. And also we can bring the price a little bit lower than the other technology. Can you lower the power consumption? Uh, that's because of the oxide? Yeah, the oxide can lower the power consumption and we will also, we, we want, we will keep improving the performance of the materials that will also uh, bring down the power consumption. How much lower the power consumption compared to not oxide? Um, no, I think uh, it de de determines on the refresh rate. If we can do like less than 10 hertz, so you will wait another 10% lower. All right. Okay. So it's not 50% less power? No, no, not, not that much. Okay. okay. And then uh, this, this is actually a pad, actually. We use the IJP for the pad. And the same pixel design, same uh, image quality. Nice. Pad. So yeah. what's the challenge? There's a layer on top for the touch and everything? Yeah, we need to add touch on that. That's the only difference from the other one. Is there a problem to add touch on, on inkjet printed no. OLED? No problem no, at all. No problem. It doesn't interfere at yeah, all? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the same as the others. OK. And this is the, 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 the biggest uh, improvement in the last year. So previous people saying that inkjet printing cannot make high resolution. Actually, we, we do that. So this one is 326 PPI with this kind of pattern. We call them real RGB pattern or the RGB strap, strap pattern. And nice. it's retina display. How do you design this kind of pattern? You need to make a bigger blue um, uh, also, a big green. Now and for the this red one, is smaller. Now for this one, now it's the same. The red, red, green, and blue is the same. Same with size. Yeah, but in the future, to the real products, we may tune this width a little bit to balance the red, green, and blue. Because the blue the needs to is, be bigger. Uh, yeah, yeah, So yeah. it stays longer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Right. Yeah. And and now how the brightness it, is going to be? Now the brightness is not not high enough. So we'll still keep improving the efficiency. All right. So a lot of things are happening with inkjet printing yeah. at TCL. Yeah. And how does it look a printer? Uh, does it look like my printer at home? Yeah, it's similar, but it's big. <laughs> All right. And uh, many, many research and development in this field yeah. from your company. Yeah. Yeah. We... Because you want to print like such a big quantity, right? Yeah. Yeah. Get the price down. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, we spend like uh, 12 hours, our company spent 12 hours in this technology. And well, personally, personally, I work on this for like almost 10 years, just this technology. 
and we got progress every year. And hopefully we'll have the mass production soon. And also we have our largest scale mass production soon. Uh, how long is it gonna last if I buy one of these? How long is it gonna <laughs> be good? What is the lifetime? Can is it gonna be 10, 20 years, no problem? Like when you buy one? 10 years these for screens? TVs, no problem. 10, 10 years, no yeah. problem. Yeah, yeah, for, for TVs. And, and for notebooks, probably five years. And the burning? The burning, all the OLED have the burning issue. So we do a lot of the compensation to do that, to make sure that there's no burning uh, when you use it.